Hey, welcome back to Feral Art. The I've still got the washing machine pan out, so we're doing another spin out edition. How you doing? Mm. Um, so this evening I have a 12 inch round canvas on my spinner set up in my washing machine pan. Because once you get this thing out, it's real hard to put it up and then get it back out. <sighs> anyway, our colors this evening are the Lucas Krill Cyan Blue stuff. Um, the same Mystery Liquitex Basics Sky Blue Light mixture of stuff. Atelier Blue Black Indigo. TLP Lakeside and Chroma Krill White with Pure White Satin Enamel. Again, we are using leftovers. <laughs> I'm really trying to get rid of leftovers, you guys. So um, let me tilt you down a little bit and we'll layer our cup and then we'll get to it. Okay, so in our cup, there we go. We're going to start off with this blue black indigo because I think I want it a little dark in my center, perhaps. We'll see. Don't have a lot of lakeside, but that's okay. You don't have to have a lot because it's really beautiful. Just stirred this up while ago, so she's still a little fresh. That's the only one. That's the only one that's not a leftover. So we're going to start off with a little bit of the blue black indigo. And then this um, Lucas Krill blue, cyan blue. This light. Hmm. Then a little bit of the TLP. just take a little over five ounces. So I'm gonna go a little more if it's okay. And I do want to end up, I think. Okay, so there's our cup. She's beautiful. Very blue. And I want to pour into this gold. Let's get the crud off of here. Okay, so here we are, way up high in the sky, like a pie in your eye. Mmm, pie. All right, a little gold in the middle. Or a lot of gold in the middle. Whatever. And a little easy spin. Good enough.
Okay. My arm gets tired out there all that time, you guys. I want this to whoosh. No, no, I think we're we're stopping right here. Ooh, wee. Wee, 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 all the way home. Let me do a little cleanup and I'll bring y'all in for a close-up. So here we are with our wet results of our spinning straight cloud pour. I think this has turned out very pretty. I like the shading in it from the white over the blue colors. I think the lines are really pretty. Um, mine isn't elegant maybe, but it just, it's so turbulent looking. I think it's cute. I really, really like the the lines and the shading in here. And the gold really didn't come through at all, anywhere. And that's okay. That's okay if it doesn't. There might still be a couple little things pop up, but I kind of doubt it. I don't really care. I think it's pretty just as it is. So there you go. What do you think? I will be back with the uh, dried results. Okay, you know I was lying. I just had to check and look, there are little bitty goldies in there and look at the shimmer from that lakeside. Ooh la wee y'all.
I am muchly in favor. Yes, indeed. Ooh, I'll be back with the dried results, y'all. Sorry, I just had a little fit there. Here's the dried results of my little cloud pour. She turned out real pretty. There's a lot of glimmer in here, but we're really not going to see it because the sun is going away and it's just going to be really hard to catch. So we'll just get up here and we'll admire the lines. I'll try to stay out of my own light. The sun is going down. And I should have been out here a little earlier. You can almost see some of the shimmer. It's just not a good light for it, but I think this little painting turned out so pretty and so soft. And I love, 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 love all the different colors of blue. So there we have our lovely little cloud pour. Happy, happy, joy, joy. What a fun one this was to do. So thanks for coming. Thanks for hanging out with me. Thanks for being so supportive. And I will see you next time.